everyone. So I've done 22 days of shorts and I can't believe I still have nine days left. I think I may break down and go shopping and buy some extra pairs for the, the, uh, for the home stretch. I'll see what happens. But I have to say that becoming a coach um, for this plan is like starting to be life changing. And you know when you like don't, um, a lot of times you're like, I'm not drinking the Kool-Aid, please. I, I can't drink the Kool-Aid of this thing. This is too good to be true. This is too, um, you know, th th this seems like, I, 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 I mean, I'll, I'd be good at it, but I don't know. I just, you know, I just don't know. And as a New Yorker, we are like trained to be so skeptical of everything. So it took me several months to get to this place of finally saying, why don't I just do this? I mean, what's wrong with me? Why don't I just do this? And I did. And I became a coach right at the end of June. So we're almost in August. I signed my eighth client today. Um, it's only, what is it today? July 27th. Um, I'm in the process of possibly signing my ninth. My, one of my um, clients brought her sister on and she's going to be a coach now and she's like wearing a go and I already can identify like some of my amazing clients who would make fantastic coaches and others who I know I would never want to you know s you know push them and make them feel uncomfortable at all because I know that they you know this might not be something that they want to do in terms of sharing their journey and living life out loud and I guess because I've lived my life out loud um, since the time I was a little kid, because I wanted to be on stage and, and perform, this is just like so natural for me. And, and especially since I guess when I was a parenting blogger or a mommy blogger and shared all the stories about my kids and working and, and trying to pursue my passion while raising a family, well now, um, within the next let's see in five days my daughter goes off to Philadelphia for her senior year at college and about a month from now a month and a couple days my son leaves the nest too and, and now it's really gonna be about me and my husband and we've been really doing a good job of um, connecting and doing fun things together I mean certainly our keeping it real show has been a joy so much fun to do that with him and we're doing really fun things but the thing that I really noticed or that he's noticed is that this plan has given me so much more confidence in anything that I'm wearing um, I used to cover up all the time and he would uh, complain and say why are you doing that you know don't cover your legs don't cover your arms what's wrong with you and I just always was so self-conscious and I hate that feeling and I know so many women um, and men too I mean it's like we, we, we you get to a weight that you just feel or size where you just feel uncomfortable in your own skin or you just you're having trouble breathing because you've put on uh, you know so much weight that it's just hard to to walk up a hill um, or to, to walk up some stairs and this is not the way we're supposed to be living our lives. And I know we all love food. I love food. I am a foodie. And I will always be a foodie. Um, but I'm learning that you can have your cake and eat it too. It just depends on the cake and the right size of the cake. And it's portion control and, and um, all kinds of other fantastic things that I have learned. Not only eating certain foods but being a part of a community where there's coaching and there's mentoring and there are so many resources to help you understand why you've made these decisions in your life over and over and over again and I just have found that um, I'm spending more time doing this on the weekends um, whenever there's a free moment I just am like I'm like a sponge and, and it was so exciting that, uh, you know, another friend called today and said, okay, I'm in, what do I need to do? And that's the thing that's like, uh, you know, you just follow this plan and I'm telling you it works. So far, um, out of the clients that have started, 
they, there have been six pound weight losses, eight pound weight losses, nine and 10 pound weight losses in the first week. I mean, those are, that's very significant. Um, but you know, the ones that lost between five and six, they only had like 20, 30 pounds to lose and, and others had a greater number to lose. But no matter what, knowing that you lose a lot in that first week gives you such incentive to keep going from one week to the next and you keep learning and, and discovering new things and um, and that's not a diet that's a journey because when it finally clicks in your head that if I start doing these things and and really kind of making it part of my life versus oh I got it go I gotta have this again I gotta have that again no I look forward to doing a lot of things on this plan now um, in fact it's like now I'm racking my brain what do I want to make for my dinner tonight because there are so many really fun options and the fact that I you know can have cheese and sauce and all kinds of other things yes I may not be having a huge bowl of pasta at the moment but I am like this close to reaching goal so those things will come back into my life and um, you know and I also took longer to to reach this goal because uh, you know life gets in the way and I did go to places and, and enjoy certain things and I still enjoy certain things but um, being able to feel comfortable in my own skin honestly feels like a million bucks so if you want to hear more about what I'm doing if you want to join my this exciting program and be a part of a group of people that are all like cheerleaders so excited to see everybody reaching their goals then what do you got to lose other than wait see you soon